Sonic or, I or found Sonic you, Faker. <laughs> nice. There you go. Okay. All right. Here we are. We're months. back. So, uh, we, uh, we up for probably last week when need we last a, played. Yeah, we probably need a little bit of a recap. Yeah, can you recap what happened last All right. Yes, time. yes, of course, of course. Uh, so, in case you don't remember, I don't know why you wouldn't, um, last we left off, you had returned from your, from a, uh, bit of a adventure in the cypress jungle uh where you had encountered a where you had to deal with a mutant crocodile uh with uh, laser eyes uh um, you do and uh you, when you got back to terrabone you found that uh, the circus was in town and that uh they had gotten randy out of jail uh specifically uh so that he could oh, work right. in their specifically so that he could work in their employ uh so, uh, you had to, it was, it was, you were very tired, it was night, so you decided you had to rest off that, you had to rest that one off and treat it in the morning. So when you did, you went to the circus and you found, uh, that, uh, Randy was indeed, uh, suddenly being trained to be, uh, an acrobat for, uh, their, uh, for their, for one of their acts, uh, and the circus had uh, some interesting characters. It was uh, weirdly, uh, it didn't seem to, it, it, it was, uh, it, it had a lot of uh, people around who seemed, it, 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 it had a lot of, you know, people, you know, visiting, uh, just doing things. Uh, when you uh, went and sat down for their acts, you saw Randy, uh, you know, basically jumping through rings. Uh, and then it he got did a very good. Job. It got yeah. He did Is pretty good. Uh, Sonic quotes at the beginning of the every ring game. Got, because <laughs> yes, because yeah. rings. Yes. Uh, there was a bit of an incident where his tail seemed to get to catch fire when it, when the ring was caught was was set on fire. But then there was like a big old. Uh, there was like a big display of like the rings jumping around and him like torpedoing through them, uh, seeming to exit one end and come out the other, even though uh, they had told you uh, that uh, they don't like warp magic, which is uh, something that they had uh, impressed upon you when you were mm. signing up to uh, with a job for them to uh, see them along the way to Regent Springs, which was their next stop. So uh, with that in mind, uh, while Felina went to go see Randall, uh, the rest of you watch the rest of the performances, and you notice that uh, they, uh, Angelo noticed that uh, an, an act involving uh, rapid transformations did not, uh, did not uh, sort of, was not in, in line with how transfiguration magic is supposed to occur. Uh, and uh, there is, it, it seemed like they were doing weird weird versions of magic or seemingly Im impossible versions of their magic and uh that seemed suspicious to or, or, or no it, it was interesting that's necessarily suspicious i believe uh but uh and also all of the acts they had out had a weirdly similar story much like randall uh all of the people they had doing these tricks were people who that they uh said were in tough, uh, no hope, like tough, hopeless situations, uh, that the circus uh, found them and uh, graciously took them in, uh, rescuing them from those situations in exchange for uh, becoming an act in the circus. It's very, for example, like uh, an orphan stuck in a, you know, you know, uh, uh, you know, an orphan whose village got struck by a hurricane and uh, someone who got, who was like stuck in a, uh, stuck down a well or whatever you know so stuff like that uh and then when it was time so you but you signed up to uh travel with the circus uh just one to keep up with randy and also to make some money uh and you uh saw them do a very strange thing which was pack up the entire circus into three boxes uh with, yeah. magic yeah with like some high tier condension magic uh uh to the point and it to the point where it was revealed that the circus really actually operated on a skeleton crew of like six people uh this those six people being uh uh arius the ringleader he is a dwarf uh 
He's Possibly a dwarf. voiced he's by a, Danny very... DeVito. <laughs> he's a dwarf with a boisterous voice, uh, very, uh, you know, very uh, charismatic ringleader. Uh, his uh, there was um, Erin, who was a, who is a uh, you know young woman uh, who uh, helped perform, who performed uh, the uh, the transfiguration magic and the water magic. Uh, during the acts, uh, she, you know, sort of has that general sort of like Vegas mu magician outfit, you know, the cocktail dress, top hat, uh, black wand, that thing. Uh, there was Buka, the receptionist, who he is a young man. He's a plant person, you know, green, leafy green skin, uh, petals for hair. Uh, there was a fish who was a... Uh, swamp person, uh, a swamp guy, who uh, was kind of cagey about his past, but, uh, and uh, just sort of, uh, just sort of did, uh, you know, labor work and, uh, you know, kept and uh, was responsible as well for, uh, you know, securing uh, food on the way whenever they, uh, where, where, where the circus traveled. And then there was Ostel, who was a, a strong man, uh, who, uh, basically also just picked up the rest of the labor that had to, had to do with uh, carrying things around and setting things up. And finally, there was the creator of the, the sort of principal creative mind behind the circus, uh, Arius's uh, partner, business partner, Dominica, who uh, was very, was very mysterious. She sort of uh, keeps in, keeps herself in the main uh, wagon. Uh, sort of shrouded behind uh, uh, a curtain, uh, hang down curtains. She's she creates all of the unique magic that the circus uses, and uh, she's always sort of just laying down uh, in that in that wagon of hers. And uh, she uh, was able to pick up on the fact that uh, she she she, uh, she she was able to pick up on a few things in terms of like uh, what was going on with uh, Angelo specifically. She picked up on you using wind magic mm. pretty quickly. Yeah. Which yeah. He's uh, not very good so... at hiding it, despite the fact <laughs> he really wants to. Yeah. Uh, well, at least that's and, what I wanted uh, for him. Yeah. And so yeah. what wound up? And so. After you, you had these six people, Buca, Erin, Ossel, Fish, Arias, Dominica, uh, they packed up the circus into three boxes, including all of their, most of their performers and all, of, uh, it just are in boxes, apparently, uh, traveling on wagons, made your way to, uh, started making your way to Regents. You traveled down, traveled down the path, uh, got on a ferry to cross the Beggar's Bayou, but then the ferry was attacked by swamp people from Mooners Island. Fish specifically was adamant that he not be seen by them. Uh, he didn't want them to know he was there. He didn't want any of them to look at him or see his face or you know anything like that. So he kind of hid out for most of the fight. It was a it was a scrap. He kind of kept you know pushing them off the boat. Uh, there was an incident with a sawn-off shotgun that uh, uh, Felina had to dance around and. Uh, you know, body snatch someone, and uh, well, basically what wound up happening was uh, you scared them off, they fled, uh, and uh, the shotgun was uh, left on the boat, which did which did the next which did the following morning reach the shore of the swamp uh, for the next leg of your journey towards Regents, which was where we left off. So man, ah, that's a good night's sleep. Man, it feels like I've slept for months. Be quiet a second, sweet. Uh, Neo, have <laughs> you got those notes written up anywhere? Uh, that was off my memory. <laughs> okay. There, there's... I uh, M does have uh, basic notes. Yeah. I keep a calendar. Yeah, yeah, she keeps a calendar to, rec to keep track of the days. That have passed in the game. What year is it? Actually, what year is it in? Uh, three thousand and five. So three thousand and five. Yeah. Do we know the date, or is yes. that like vague? Today, if we're waking up the next morning, I assume, right? Yes. Yep. 
Uh, today is the morning of Friday, July 29th, 3005. Oh, damn. I can't wait to play Resident Evil 4 in 3005. <laughs> On the GameCube! On the GameCube. Hell yeah. Okay, yeah, of course, so... the circus has, you know, a little GameCube. Usually they rent it out to kitties, but, you know. There's always yeah. just a few carnies just running Smash sets. Mm. I was going to say, Sweet, I don't know. Can you uh, elaborate on that a little bit? I don't quite understand. Well, you see, going. when the, the circus is in town, they have mm. a little tent set up where they pay, where a kid can pay like an insane amount of money to play, play video games on the, sm on the GameCube for a few minutes. So okay. let's let's open up on a scene. Uh, you're sort of just waiting uh, around the three wagons. They're sort of situated at the start of the road, while uh, Arius is just hashing things out with uh, the ferryman, uh, you know, due to the incident. Uh, and you know he's just taking care of that. And once he's back, you'll uh, start setting off again. But right now you're just sort of hanging around. Uh, Buka and Erin are on. Uh, are we're. Uh, sort of are by one wagon fish and also on another and then uh dominica is inside her wagon and uh you guys are wherever you guys are it's up to you so we open on that scene uh -huh. so hmm. We're next morning. We're still in the swamp. You said, like, still yeah, yes, right? yes, okay. yes. Just like just outside the do just outside the docks. Uh, you no, know, go to the beggars by you. Well, we're... since it's a, oh, go ahead. No, I was gonna say since it's a swamp, <laughs> yes, go. <laughs> Fucking mosquitoes. Ah. Oh yeah, nice. um, Angela is a constant kind of just air propelling mosquitoes away. <laughs> nice. And they oh, go on to they go on to hero, so that's why you just God. Nice immersion. I like it. Yeah. Gonna catch that's malaria all. to really get in character. Angela yeah, can also control the humidity around. I don't actually know if that's part of the power <laughs> whatsoever. <laughs> Cons Why is Angel also stupidly overpowered? <laughs> the mage class is just kind of vague yeah. powers. This Literally isn't like a powers. It's, it's not like a stupid comic book. Is this like a stupid comic book thing where, like, if we get like the biggest nerd, they can say, "Well, because he controls condensation, he could actually create storms." Oh no, he literally Cond can. Um, <laughs> well, there we go. Storms like, are his main thing. Yeah, actually, look. Here's the the thing about the mage is there's no upper <laughs> limit. The idea of if I decide I'm going to call in a tornado, and and I do, it's just basically if I fuck that up, the it's even more catastrophic, you know. Yeah. So basically, the more uh, is basically the more I put in, the worse it can uh, go. And, and also, and also, if he does that, it can't cause any mechanical damage. <laughs> Not direct damage. Yeah. Yeah. He I can do, do indirect, that. though. The problem with that being Dungeon <laughs> World is. You know if I'm doing that, I do want to cause damage. So where is the oh, uh, ideological <laughs> line on direct? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If I if All I right. use wind to push someone off of a rooftop, is that direct? It is pretty direct. Mm. Well, you are just pushing them but off. You're the thinking... crowd that's hurting them, not me. Yeah. So, you know, it might not cause mechanical damage. So, you know, he might just, uh, the person might, I don't know, catch on to something. Yeah. Who knows? Basically, that's how it works, James. <laughs> yeah. I can't do anything that's static or calm or create anything solid or permanent. So, right. It still has to be dynamic. But that's so okay because you, you can use other stuff. You... So, wait, Snake, you can't create a share out of air? I know. No, because he, no, because he literally, well, he we slept on an airbed. That's true, actually. <laughs> that, that shouldn't have worked. Well, that was anything, that that was all... anything but stable for everyone yeah. in the house. And plus, technically, it worked, it, and plus it worked like a uh, hovercraft. <laughs> it wasn't solid, and it wasn't calm, so... I guess, um, yeah. I guess anyway, Angelo is just kind of... Um, he's just kind of going around making sure everyone's getting, like, packed up and good to actually hit the road that day just yeah. like just, right right i mean it's all condensed so it's like what three wagons two or three wagons yep yeah, yeah three wagons so basically wow, just like... making sure everything's packed up and 
you know, he's how just... convenient for the person organizing this that he doesn't need to tr- keep track of like several carts. You know, that's convenient for us too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> True. Uh, think... Yep, yeah, everything seems in order. Uh, looks like it. Looks like uh, the, the none, there was no. It looks like no one, none of the swamp people did. You know, got to got that close, so they didn't get. They thankfully didn't do much damage. That's good. Oh yeah, now okay, now everything is kicking back into order because I used that. Even though you explained it, I had a bit to remember, but now now I remember. Yeah, no, I now I remember. <laughs> Some poor boss that kept getting kicked back in. Poor bastard. Well, I was going to say, one of the carts just, just did have a... Of, just for the sake of fact this is a recording in Camberwatch Future, earlier earlier I made a really disgusted noise, and that's because I learned truly disgusting news that I will not say on air. It's the Chris Chan thing, right? It is the Chris Chan thing, yes. Ah, I, yeah, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I don't know, yeah. I see, but this is the thing, I'm it's being okay. looking... I, I have been oh. Googling, and I don't know if it's I actually... I don't sure. know this. Close your eyes. It's, 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 it's... Don't think about it. Anyway. Okay. You know, if I fit, if I close my eyes, it just makes it clearer. Don't worry. Okay. Let's just say we're in a fantasy world. Their favorite Fine. game is Big Mother Truckers, but that's we're, it. we're in a fantasy world. All right. Speaking of a fantasy world, didn't one of the carts have a big hole in it? Um, yeah. Uh, so not a huge hole. Not, but a... Yeah, yeah. So that's the one What's exception. The one? Uh, no. Was uh, the 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 cart that uh, fish. An ocelot by, uh, got it. It, it got a uh, hit. It, it will not direct. It got uh, fish was sort of cowering behind that cart because so he didn't want to be seen. Uh, so uh, when there was a shotgun blast through through uh, the wall, uh, its cart sort of splintered a bunch of uh, quite a bit of the cart, but none, none none of the goods inside are damaged. Anything we can do to maybe patch it up a little bit? Uh, maybe there, 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 there is spare wood around if you like. If you would like to patch that card up, yeah. Let me, uh, let me, let me have a, let me have a go. Not so much. Well, yeah, just for fixing the integrity and also looks less suspicious going into town. I would think. Alrighty. Uh, why don't you roll wisdom for me? Okie dokie. First roll of six weeks or eight weeks. And I got oh, a six. Geez. Big sexy. Oh no. well, wow, you're not as dingo. See, that's bad voodoo. That's bad voodoo. Uh, does can anybody help me after the fags? Uh, sure. Yeah. Oh, cool. I'll I'll yeah, assist. Wants to help out. Yeah. Getting wood. Lena will help him. Licking her wounds and sulking about getting her uh roll. I have to remember how to do this shit. Plus bonds. Plus bonds. I have two of those things. Oh really? Yeah. We... It, yeah. No. No, 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 no good. Now I'm tied up in your um, consequences. If anyone else, um, <laughs> I think Hero should try before I do because he's a hero. Yeah, Hero, you should want this. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I'm, I'll I'm help inspe- you. I'm inspecting the carts. I've missed the big hole. So. Yeah. Where the fuck is my sheet? Oh god, I've forgotten how to uh, organize. Uh, how many bonds did I have with you? Uh, the Dingo one. Oh, I only have one with you. This is gonna be fun. R two D six plus one. A. Right. Well, well, that's a seven. Bigger. Yeah, there you go. Yes. Uh, so yeah. Don't uh, worry, Felina. You know, I got this. Yeah, the three of you sort of go around looking, you know, for uh, good wood to use. Uh, uh, as a uh, Felina, uh, sort of, uh, and and Dingo, as you, uh, as you two sort of, you know, spread out a bit to look for good wood, uh, you are. Uh, uh, Aaron actually shouts out to you. It's like, hey, don't go too far. You go, you, you, there's a, there, uh, we're, this is, keep in mind, if we're in the swamp now. If we get off the path, this, those snakes, they're gonna come and they're not gonna be happy. I'm gonna come. I'm already not happy. It's well, okay. We're just looking for wood. I don't think you're poisonous. You don't think. I don't know. Oh, right, yeah. Venomous, sorry. Thank you. Um, so we can either stick with the cart and not fix it, or we can try uh, and get wood no, from outside. No, no you, you get it. Oh. Fine, yeah, with, with Hero's help. Okay. 
But I uh, think Felina's like had helping, but mostly it. just following okay. Dingo around, around complaining and danger. distracting him. Yeah. Ah, so that... you're a cat. You're just being a cat again. Yeah, you get the wood, and uh, I'd say Austal uh, and Fish sort of help out. You know, just sort of you know patch up the cart. Uh, as uh, Arius seems to be uh, getting off what? the ferry. To having finished his business. What was that, sweet? Oh, sorry. I was just thinking out loud because I forgot what yeah. skills I had. Right, sorry. So... I don't really have anything particularly relevant here. Right, yeah, none of it's alright. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm, ready I'm just happy for yep, yep. the ball. Yeah, to yeah. Me. Arya shows up and says, All right, so it is. T all right. Took care of that fairy business. Well, let's get ourselves to Regents. Don't want to burn too much daylight now. Fairies? Is there a fairy around here? What? Fairy business. I haven't met a fairy yet. Fairy. <laughs> fairy. Double, double R fairy, not, uh, uh, not AI As fairy. in boat, Felina? As in Brian fairy. From a band that probably exists in the setting, folk, uh, Broxy Music. So, uh, we are going, so, we're going to have to be following, uh, we're going to have to stay on the path so that we don't run into uh, any trouble. Uh, every, you guys, you, uh, you guys better, uh, looking at, uh, you know, the party, he says, you guys better keep, uh, keep an eye out. Since this is one contiguous path, there might be some uh, unscrupulous highwaymen. Uh, like to try their chances in the Saren Swamp. Oh, don't worry. We'll we'll take care of them. No worries. And then once we're out of the swamp in the marsh, uh, I would very much like to just get to Regents. So I want. I would like if we would just take a sharp turn north off the path as once we're in the marsh. All oh, we're gonna miss Seneca. Hmm. I uh, mm. I I kind of wanna. Spout lore on whether that's a good idea. Yeah, I was thinking that as well. Alright, spout lore. <laughs> Turns out Angelo has no yeah. call. And Angelo <laughs> just gives a big thumbs up. Says, <laughs> says, sir, off the path we'll go. I was gonna ask, can I help, or does that make does that not make a lot of sense for spout lore? Yeah, that doesn't lore? make sense for you. Yeah, you wouldn't know. Alright. I'm not I guess Angelo just has so, is was so sheltered that he doesn't really hasn't really read the it's map just, or something. So yeah, so yeah, you'll head north once you hit this spot. This I mean, spot. Angelo, Angelo came fr came from the north pretty far as well, but doesn't doesn't mean he can't no no no. It means he probably well. followed the path here and didn't think about it. Yeah. Actually, actually, the critical failure is he has an enormous brain hemorrhage roll. <laughs> D6 damage. He gives a thumbs up, gives a grin. Right, sir, off the path we'll go, and then just tumbles off the <laughs> whatever he was doing. Like, I imagine one, he was one, sitting on one of the carts that you guys one, 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 one half of his body stops blowing. <laughs> so he just starts, like, he's his body crumbling, and he just... <laughs> he's just he's spinning, spinning around on the spot. <laughs> As All he's right. having a stroke. So oh, no. for the first leg of this journey, just through the swamp road, I just want someone to cat to uh cast to roll scout. Uh, what is uh, that? I, I can oh, do that. No, you go ahead. Yeah, scout I, is look, wise them. Yeah, wise look, them. and I'm very wise, despite Tiro being a dumbass. Yeah. Uh, how you play him? Provisions, because yeah, I'm gonna say provisions are being handled uh by fish for this since he got fish and uh uh. Uh, you've got Arius with the map and the road. I found fish. You found yourself? Yes. Alright, so, uh, Hero, I'm gonna need you to choose one from the Scout Ahead list. It's in handouts. Danke, danke. Uh, we're gonna find... Okay, choose one from... I'm gonna say you discern a beneficiary aspect of the terrain. Shortcut, shelter, you know, I just find, you know, a really nice path through this swamp that isn't as swampy and, you know, easier to get Well, through. that would be the path. Um, fuck. Which uh, we are going <laughs> off the path. Or, well, Angelo's <laughs> going to argue we go off the path because he's a cocky moron. Okay, mm -hmm. no, then let's... 
Rewind it. We get the drop on whatever lies ahead. All right, drop on whatever lies ahead. Got you. Got it. Family of banjo playing frogs. <laughs> <laughs> Can we be frog here? All right. So, uh, hero, as you're scouting, as you're you know sort of you know getting on ahead, you uh, happen to notice uh, you see two. Uh, you see uh, two people uh, in sort of uh, shrouds uh, look to be, uh, have these sort of trowels and they're digging at the sides of the path. Hmm. <laughs> okay, you know, I'm gonna just. Do I hear them mutter anything or. Uh, they. No, you, well, you'd have to get a little closer to hear, oh, yeah, no, to hear I'm gonna... if they're muttering anything. Okay, wait. Uh, would this be a decent reality roll? Because I want to see if there's like a perch or good place to sp spy from. Uh, yeah, discern realities, certainly. Yes. Certainly discern realities. Ah. Wait, what is roll. that again? That's roll, wisdom. Roll, right? That's wisdom. That's wisdom. Ah. All right. Yeah, you got three questions to ask about uh, this situation. You got uh, so yeah, you're you've gone ahead in the path. There are two people. There are two sh people in shrouded hoods, uh, with hmm. trowels. Uh, Digging at the sides of the path. Okay, 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 so okay. What are okay. your questions? Hmm. First thing, you know what? Hmm. First thing, let's throw abuse at them. <laughs> no, okay. Um. Let's see now. What here is not what it appears to be. Like these don't look. Hmm. Actually, right. hmm. Yeah. So, so yeah, so yeah, you're you're trying to you're so yeah, you've uh quieted down and you're sort of like sort of trying to keep out of their peripheral vision and like just try and like see if they're yeah. saying anything uh mm -hmm. one of them looks at you hear you manage to hear one of them uh mention the others the others uh, okay. yeah one of them asks one, yeah one of them it was like all right so the others uh they're they, you're sure they're nearby and they're, they're they're fine yeah they're fine all right okay 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 um what hmm what is useful of no actually hmm what is what is about to happen I feel what is like I can I use that as in what can I discern what they're yeah. planning right 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 okay so yeah you're looking uh at what they're doing uh the way they're shoveling uh any sort of uh, any sort it looks like so looking at the way they're shoveling, it looks like any like the way they're doing this, any cart that passes over this area is going to just suddenly tumble like to the side, to one of the sides, into the swamp proper. Okay. Okay, now I'm just now I'm debating here if I wanna say who's really in control there or what should I be out on the lookout for? Hmm. I think I take what should I be on the lookout for? Like yeah, right. yeah, yeah, it's good. It's good, yes. Alright. So, yeah, uh... Alright, so yeah, uh... One of them, uh, looks up and just says, uh... Almost looks at you, but doesn't quite see you. You're, uh, taking out... Yeah. You're, you're out of their peripheral vision, thankfully. Uh, and one of them says, Alright, I think something's downwind. Let's, uh, get ready. Like one of them's downwind. Looks like, uh... That's uh. That's my fault. Let's let's get let's get the others in too. Let's, let's, let's get the other. Let's get the others in. Let's get the others into position. And, Ooh. Uh, get ready to take and get ready to see what happens when they get out into the swamp. Well, hero is just gonna have to do the one thing he he should do. Oh no. That's right. He's gonna teleport out of there and warn his party in advance. Nice. Oh, thank you. And what? So I'm just he's hero is gonna teleport away. Gotcha. Should I roll for this? You do not have to. You. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. You have uh, you have Fine. that sort of you know free uh, reach porting. So. <laughs> so you can sort of arrive uh, at yeah. the at at the convoy. Oh yeah, actually. <laughs> So actually, is the cart? Is there like someone at, at the front the three, of the cart? Yeah. Uh, let's see. The lead cart would be uh, one with uh, the, the the lead cart would be 
would be uh, Aaron and Buka. Dominica <laughs> and Arius are in the middle, and then Fish and Oss will take up the rear. Well, I just want to uh, be—I want to be really thematic here, and just for the hell of it, he, can I say when he teleports in, he just teleports next to him and says, "Yo." Yeah, so yeah, Buka, who had, who is sort of, uh, you know, uh, you know, driving the cart, like suddenly, like, like freaks, like, whoa, 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 oh, gee, I forgot you could do that. What's up? Um, a uh, couple of bandits up ahead, current digging a trench or something to have our carts fall into it. Uh, all right. I saw two. So, uh, I saw. I saw two. There should be more of them there. No. All right. So I'm gonna say uh, one of you. Uh, since there's three carts, there should be one of you at each cart. So uh, in addition to the two who are riding. So uh, who wants to be the one relaying this to everyone? Who wants to be the one who hears this? Uh, me. Volunteer. All right. All right. Angela. Yeah. Yeah. So you're at the first cart with Aaron and Buka when he uh, teleports in and says that. Hmm. Did you? Uh, did he mention the traps, or did he? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's, he's not, he, yeah. He said, yeah there, is yeah. there any? Yeah. Do we have enough room on the path ahead to evade the traps? Hmm. Do we actually need, or is it like really narrow? Uh, it looked like they had made quite a bit of progress. So, uh, it it, it would be you'd, you'd have to maneuver pretty slowly. Yeah, we would have to be really slow. they taking like most of it. And I suppose either way, they are setting up there would be wandering into their trap could be fun exactly hmm do you have some i'll go tell i'll go tell the See others Let... oh, right yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah definitely yeah at this yeah at this point yeah Aaron has has probably thrown up a signal to get the other cards to stop moving yeah and angelo goes and tells felina and big sexy aka <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> we had a thingo started telling us to just call him that. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's he's evading it. He's evading the law. That's his. Uh, that, that's, that's his bandit a, name. Is big. He just sexy. became a furry. This, I don't that's know. That's another baseball player. Big sexy. Oh, that's that's a good name. Yeah, he's great. He's 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 fun to watch. Okay, so yeah, group meeting. Uh, hero spotted two bandits up ahead, digging out uh, the path to uh, force the cart to tumble away. So they did not look happy about it. You believe there's going to be more of them? Yes, they mentioned more of them getting in positions. I don't know which positions, but you know positions. Do you think you can, you know, magic us across the road? Polina asks, looking to. Uh, Angela, I could, ma I could maybe, I could maybe float us. I could try and maybe float us across, cushion us on a little, on a little bed of wind. But that's chancy. We kind of have the whole circus in mm, there. Yeah. Don't want to do anything chancy. You can't like fix the road or whatever. That seems less likely to get everyone killed. I imagine we'd be fixing the road while in the crosshairs of every bandit watching it. Hmm. Uh, Hero did get a good look at the traps, didn't he? He did. And he knows uh, what kind of traps they are, right? Which are, yeah, they're are basically they... pit, they're, they're basically uh, like small little pitfalls that will make you know any cart passing through you know tumble to the side. Oh right. I have a I have a thought. Though it doesn't, mm -hmm. it doesn't repair the road, it might make our job a little bit easier. If they're pitfalls, I imagine they've done some work to cover them up. Mm. Yeah. Why don't I just displace them? Draw the that bandits was out the suggestion. The Draw the bandits yeah. out into the open to try and repair them once again, and then we turn the ambush back on them. There we go. Mm. Because I was going to suggest shooting them, but that sounds like a better idea. Well, that's that could be a prelude to shooting them. That's true, yeah. Wow. Sh Someone... shoot, shooting's a good plan, B. I mean, I'm saying yeah. that out of character. Uh, yeah. I'm saying uh, that out of character because I can't remember Dingo's voice. But... Yeah, I'll say also brings uh, the strong man. He brings up. All right, so if we. So if we're going on ahead, we should. And uh, we do that, we're going to have to maneuver uh, pretty carefully not to. Get so that the you know, the wagons don't tumble down. 
which will give them ample time to still try something on us. Why would we? Move, we... Why would we move the carts into it? I'm saying we. I'm saying we move ahead, displace the bandits, and then we start moving mm -hmm. the cart again. All right. So bodies now, carts later. Just well, let them know that we know that they're there. I feel it would be easier for us to deal with the bandits if we don't also have to protect the carts at the same time. Yeah, Arius uh, nods and says, "That's a that's yeah, a good that's good thinking. Good thing we hired you." Yeah, look at the big tactical brain on this guy. Check out the big ops and tactics. Check <laughs> out the big. Also, was just a bit sheepishly about being common. It just just seemed like common sense to me. Check out the big mm -hmm. brain on Brad. I don't know, and you know that's really smart. I wouldn't have thought of it. I love you. <laughs> uh, we don't. Are we sure there's really no way to like? sneak past us or anything no other options we do we have <laughs> that's that's a fairer point if we could avoid this if actually no sorry that's not what angelo would say angelo would do, angelo's not going to be logical about it Rewind. no no no, the no we must i like no, to imagine that like <laughs> angelo starts saying that's a fair point and then cuts himself off no that's not what angelo would say in this situation and like interrupts himself to angelo say wants to fight but yeah let's time. actually go so angelo does say that's a fair you kind of catch saying that's a fair and then he's like well they'd still they they might still find us huh even if well, we, true, yeah. even if we try and go around bandits are covering the roads Right then. So, uh, you four going to you four think you can handle it, or do you want, or do you want some, or you want one, one or two of uh, one, one or two of mine as backup? We've got this well in hand. Yeah, they were wonderful, they were... wonderful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll mm -hmm. be waiting for we'll be waiting for your return. And yeah, well, punk. We can take them. We could have we, we could have thrown some NPCs at this. That's a shame. <laughs> Felina is suddenly finding out that um. You four are dealing with this, and we're not yeah. taking any NPCs to help us. Yeah. That's good. So yeah, um, just so... like smash cut to we're a bit ahead, and Felina's yeah. just like trapped in a hole. Yeah, <laughs> I can't believe they talked me into this. Being dragged along to oh, well, hero, oh man, lead. hero, lead the way. Show us to these. Sure thing. Sure thing. Teleports away. Oh, into a uh, hole. Com com wait, comes back. Oh yeah, you can't do that. Sorry. No, we can't. We we can't quite do that. It's this way. Grandpa holds back. He's going in the. Him and Felina in the back. I think you two go <laughs> ahead. Uh, yeah. <laughs> he, it's dragging her by her tail. Felina's just muttering. I could have at least taken one of their bodies out here. Well, Grandpa gives you a fat look, and you say that. So yeah, you approach the part of the road that's been uh, trapped up, uh, Angelo. It's uh, you're you're you gonna do it? The yeah, thing? I'm looking, yeah. O I'm looking make, over make where like friends. they were digging, and I'm and I was kind of asking yeah. Hero to kind of like point out, and then basically all I'm gonna do is like have a really really strong wind kind of blow through and just kind of try and basically knock the traps loose, make it so that the pitfalls that they've probably covered over are you know just revealed. Gotcha. All right. Uh, roll. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, cast a uh, cast your spell. God, we have so many characters. I should not close my sheet. What's any time? Then I have to find it again. All right. <laughs> okay. There is a fruit fly in my room that keeps landing on my screen. I gotta get rid of it. Awful. Yeah. Wow. Hey Gary, oh, did you? I try did not. To, I don't like killing insects, so I just try and. Yeah. yeah. Hey Gary, Ooh. do you fasten the trap? That's a twelve plus. That is a twelve plus. It's a good thing I got spell weaver. Choose nothing yeah. from the list. It just so yeah, nothing just goes works. wrong. It just works. Just it works. just works. It just works. So yeah, it just works. Uh, you a strong gust of wind just bellows forth, and immediately, like all the like, just a. Dirt just flies flies forward, revealing revealing pitfalls. Damn it, Gus! I told you to pass revealing them. The on exact the locations. Now we have to decide. Oh. What, now we wait for them to. We wait for any of them to go into place to repair it, and we spring our <laughs> we spring our trap. Ah, and you, 
Uh, mm, very smart, Angelo. Meanwhile, while they those two did that, did, uh, I'm going to say that me, uh, Dingle and Felina are keeping their eye out for the people who may have set up the traps. Uh, all right. Uh, roll wisdom. Okay. Okie dokie, Dingo. Uh, out of the corner of your eye, uh, mm -hmm. you see uh, as Angelo and uh, Hero are waiting for them to come out and investigate what happened to the trap. Uh, since you're behind, you see someone try to sneak up from from the foliage uh, behind them uh, and behind you to uh, try to uh, to uh, try and uh, make a surprise uh, sort of uh, like dart attack. attack. Yeah, it looks, uh, like he has on, a blow dart. looks like he has a blow dart. On us. Huh? As as in, I mean, Felina, not on those two. No, on, on no, uh, yeah, on, on, on those two actually. On oh. those two, he he has a blow dart, and it looks like he's about to uh, fire at. Uh, he actually looks like he, it looks like he's about to fire at Angelo. Okay. Um. Hmm. How far would you say the distance is, like running wise? Uh. Probably, uh, like, 10 or, 10, 10 or 12 feet. Okay, would I be able to, like, run and tackle him? In uh, yeah, yeah, he's going slow, so he doesn't, because he doesn't want to be seen. Okay, um, I might go for a risky move then and go for a, uh, tackle. Alright, uh, roll hack and slash. Okay, okay, uh, this isn't precise, this is just using strength, yeah? Yep. Yeah, I can slash the, yeah. Oh, no. no good. All right. Oh, no. Yeah. So yeah, you see that, and you start charging, but like he whips around and he like he sees you coming, and like sort of like immediately just redirects his attack to you. Oh dang it! Yeah. Oh no! It's a shame you didn't uh... like shot, breathe in, and shock, and just swallow. Yeah, that's what I was thinking as well, and started choking <laughs> on it. Yeah. Uh. So yeah, you get a. So yeah, you get a, a dart lodged in your in your shoulder. Oh, ouch! Oh no! Grandpa's gonna die. Uh, take three damage. Oof. <gasps> um, and... what kind of dart is it? Can I immediately tell? Well, uh, you know, what? yeah, yeah. Roll, roll in. Roll spell lore. Spell lore. Uh, which is wisdom. Yeah, or... that's int. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Nothing. All right. Mm. Well, roll constitution. You're getting okay. some XP. That's, yeah, that's good. It appears that I have been okay. chunked. Uh, so, uh, you sort of, uh, feel, you, 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 you feel sort of, uh, sort of woozy. Yeah, I figured. Yeah, like, uh, sort of, like, 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 you, like, like you feel like, sort of, like, your strength being sapped, but, uh, it's sort of just, like, you kind of just kind of grit your teeth, and, like, it, it, you can, like, sort of make, like, a momentary stumble. Uh, okay. but right now you are open as, uh, he seems to, uh, whistle to call out, uh, the rest of his buddies, which, oh. uh, I think, which everyone else should notice by now. Yeah. Oh no, oh no. <gasps> oh no, Angelo, they pull, pulled an ambush on us, pulling an ambush on their ambush. Well, that's fine. We'll just Layers. have to reverse their ambush. They How many ambushes bush. are we talking about here? So yeah, there's rustling from the foliage as uh, it looks like uh, three more guys uh, sort of make their make th in shrouded hoods make their uh, make themselves known. Uh, sort of make themselves known. They have daggers and they have uh, uh, they have daggers and they have uh, small sort of like bamboo sticks. Just a question, actually, because I was following. Um... Because I was following Hero, what was our position in this? Like, on the ground behind a tree, like secret. Uh, I I I think it in the open. Oh, think, it's sort yeah, of yeah, the bushes. open. Yeah, just sort of on the path. Okay, right. On the path. <laughs> and uh, yeah, one of them just yells out, "It's like, <laughs> like, where's your cart? <clears throat> what cart? <clears throat> yeah." Ha we we heard we heard we saw we were we had we scouted we saw you we saw you were with carts. No, you didn't. 
must have spotted nice us. Nice gaslighting hero. Good job. <laughs> Actually, you know, can I roll a charisma this roll on good, that? Just no, saying, this no. is a good gambit. This is a good gambit. <laughs> no, you can't roll charisma on that. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. Hero gets a fucking thread about him on Twitter for gas. <laughs> <That's good. laughs> I must say your trap your trap was rather obvious. Yeah, I found it. Yeah. Well <laughs> you, you tap it with your foot and fall in. Angelo just cut Angelo just kind of approaches this guy, kinda of like arms outstretched. Listen, I don't know quite what you want out of this, but you're not going to get it, so why not let us pass peacefully, and it'll save you a few bruises. <laughs> Don't know whether you know who I am. They That's call me basically Big what Sexy. Angela's pulling, but with no name to himself. <laughs> You're messing with a circus bodyguard, you <laughs> They call me Big Sexy, and I'm gonna show you why. <laughs> Buddy, the circus is in town. <laughs> yeah. hmm. Here's a counteroffer. How about you go back to your carts and you have them come this way like nothing happened? Hey. And, and no. let them fall. I have another um, counter offer. And in exchange, <laughs> yeah. we tell you how to counteract the poison we just pumped in the old, we just pumped in the, oh, beard, no. in the bearded guy's veins. <laughs> no what need for that counter offer. You're going to talk before I'm done with you. And Angela's just going to like dive at the guy. Ooh. Felina, I will say, Felina hearing that does like, you know, dash up to, you know, do, does a big old slide down to the side <laughs> of Hero. Like, oh, hey, poison? What happened? Um, old man got hit by it. Or not Hero, Hero. Um, yeah, the fuck, Dingo. Dingo. Yeah. Dingo. Yeah. Dingo, yeah. Um, for, for some reason, I, for, for some reason in my head, Angelo's move was going to be, he does a whip of, like, air to, like, knock the guy off his feet. Um, well... <laughs> I'm gonna be a I'm gonna be a piece of shit because I'm trying to I'm still in the process. But I think I figured out with Angelo he's gonna do melee moves that are magically empowered. So basically, okay, he, he like dives for the guy and basically gust of wind like basically propelling him his whole body right. forward. Oh, okay, into like a super giant punch, leaping like a punch. Superman punch. It's yeah, a Superman I imagine punch. Well, I'm several feet away from this guy, but yeah, like Angelo just on a gust of wind just. Yeah. I imagine it would be very surprising for this guy, assuming it was. Yeah, yeah, roll black magic, definitely. Yeah, that Angelo suddenly like leaps several feet forward with no run to just deck this yeah. guy. <laughs> yeah. No, he... Exactly. Yeah, it it is just a Superman he, punch. Isn't he, it? Yeah, he just like, he just wireworks this guy. That's good. So, um, obviously, fist range, <laughs> fit hand yep. distance. It's been a few months. Yep. I'm just gonna start calling it fist distance. <laughs> fist range. Fist distance. Distance. The new Sylvester Stallone film coming to Redbox. And it's uh, if you're not paying attention, okay. So um, forceful, piercing. I guess just forceful and piercing. I'm not doing two down. I'm not doing two targets. Gotcha. I could throw that in, but it doesn't really fit the narrative at the moment. That I'm just fucking diving at this guy. Yeah. Alrighty. Uh, Felina, you ran up to Dingo, didn't yeah. you, and asked about poison? Is, yeah, uh... she, like, sort of slides yeah. in next to uh, the scene. I, 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 scene is done. I genuinely can't remember his voice, but he just kind of looks at you. He was like Australian like, yeah. cowboy. <laughs> was he Australian? He was Australian. Oh no, I'm mixing he, it up he with your like, earlier uh, gunslinger yeah, character. There we go. Yeah, oh yeah, he turned out to He had a draw. He had a draw. Oh, he should... Oh yeah, he just... He just looks like it just looks Philly and he's just like, Yeah, got me in the goddamn shoulder. You think you can suck it out? Uh, <laughs> that was not what? his voice. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I genuinely can't remember. Uh, it's been eight weeks. Yeah, we're gonna have to yeah. grab an old recording. <laughs> um, um I could I can suck it out. I don't think I'm going to, but here <laughs> So <laughs> yeah, he sort of mm. nice examines it. And yeah. you know, she's Looks at the color of the thing, yeah. sees its viscosity, rolling that it drops it. Yep, and asks about some the symptoms. Baby. Oh wow. Okay. So uh, as Angelo punches this man, uh, Superman punches this guy back into the foliage, uh, uh, drawing attention. Felina, you uh, see that uh, this is uh, this looks like 
cultivated cultivated snake venom. Interesting. Uh, oh. Which is very hard to get a hand of. And you need like an anti venom. That's and and it's like uh like the effect it has on the body like it like it's like it it is basically just like a slow shutdown. Like it starts with being drowsy, like you start to move more, you start to move more slow, and eventually, like you know, parts of your body just stop working. Like your arms just stop working. You'll start, be, you'll stop being able to uh, move your neck, and you'll eventually, you'll stop being able to open your eyes. Okay, cool. I think I'm the, resisting I, the urge me, the to key... start flexing my knowledge of how uh, snake oh, venom okay, works cool. and asking I unnecessary think, questions. I think the key horror part there is. Hard to cultivate, which might might imply a connection with the masters of this joint. Mm -hmm. But so it's um snake venom, so I assume he talks about antidote, so it would I assume anti venom is, is the you know. Uh yeah, an anti venom would be about as hard to cultivate as the venom itself. Well, yeah, yeah, it would yep. all and that's yeah, you typically need to like make the anti venom from the exact type of venom and so yeah, he's he's probably not bluffing then, um, about the um venom. Hmm. Yes. So yeah, Felina looking at that sniffs and goes, Oh wow, no, he hmm. well, um lived a long life. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're, 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 he's, he's in his early, early thirties. He's, he's done. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna suck that out. Just go fucking die. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I don't wanna. I don't wanna thing you, James. But I don't okay. think sucking out venom actually is a thing. That's I don't know. It does work. <laughs> it, it, it depends. <laughs> on, okay, so this is start <laughs> when we get into their different hey, types I, of snake Hey, venom. don't don't worry oh, no. about it. Don't worry about it. Also, I don't think there's a reason to piss on jellyfish words. things. I don't think that works either. No, I know it's good because you get to wee on somebody. That's the joke. Because <laughs> you All get right. to wee. Like, that's the grand opportunity here. <laughs> yeah, a bunch of science is just yeah, like yeah, trick people sure into it. Games, yeah, there yes. are people that would pay you to do that. What pay me? Like as in like there's people that pay, that pays to pay, have people. James, you've been in the thumbnail yes. business. Now it's time to yes. move on to the waterworks business. Get, time That's to go. Into, time to go into the business. <laughs> oh, this is on the evil. This is good. Yeah, there, there's a shout from uh, the bush where you knock the guy in. And just says up, uh, who just he just yells out in pain. Focus him! Focus him! Oh, uh, look, I'm just, I'm just gonna say. Hero does show Angelo. That punch was awesome. And Angelo, I mean, yes, it are... yes, it was. So yeah, Angelo, uh, a dagger flies your way. Okay, now it's time to go full anime. <laughs> just... <laughs> As uh, I want to deflect it with my van brace. Ooh, See is that anime? Your princess. That's pretty anime. Deflecting a throw yeah. knife with a van brace. I was thinking of Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. <laughs> yeah, no, Famous, no, no. famous yeah, anime so, uh, Wonder Woman. Okay, yeah, yeah, roll Dex. <laughs> Wonder Angel oh, Wonder no. Angelo. No, that's not the worst. Oh no. Oh no, that's yeah. okay. That's what makes it sense. Alright, so uh basically what this so I'm gonna say uh you can avoid being cut by it. But like you're trying to, you're gonna have to sort of like fumble with it to like make sure it doesn't touch, make sure the blade doesn't touch skin, and that'll give uh one of the uh the others time to make it a different attack on you. Sure. All right. Basically, I'm gonna say you're gonna get tackled to the ground. Okay. Right. So Actually, yeah, you fumble catching this dagger, and then uh, in fact, well, was, no, the I guy. Mean, just for the narrative, even though it's like, yeah, it was basically like a side swipe, like knocking it astray. With the van brace was the idea of it, but it doesn't matter. It's like it's either taking all my attention or you know just opening me up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna say yeah, yeah. Like the, the way you butt it, like it it, it sort of does like a, it, it makes like a little a bit of a dangerous spin that you have to take care not to get you know scratched by. And that's when uh one was when uh one of the other four one of the other four uh, uh tackles you to the ground. Oh no. 
Yeah. Well, Hero sees it and just shouts Angelo, and he's running towards. He's gonna run towards him to try and get that guy off him. All right, Hero, what do you do? Quick, Hero, get this yeah. guy off. <laughs> yeah, no, Hero. We've hmm. already Hero. done that bit with Randall. <laughs> <laughs> well, Hero is gonna run up, and basically he's gonna. T- <laughs> it's gonna be. He's tackling the guy who tackled Angelo. Basically, be- trying to tackle him off. You're gonna actually, beat no, him off with gonna hands. Fl- no, 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 actually, no. He saw that Angelo. Okay, he's gonna have to upstage Angelo here. Angelo did a did a punch. Big flying so Superman was- punch. Yeah, so Hero's gonna have to do a kick. <laughs> Fuck, I have an I have a perfect idea. You're Hang gonna on. do the Shadow the Hedgehog kick. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Teleport kick. Go. All right, yeah, roll, roll hack and slash. Don't they have to roll? Yeah. Oh, is this close enough that I can just teleport, whatever? Yeah, yeah, just roll strength. Yep. Um, as they're doing this, I'm raising my hand. I have, I have a quick question. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm. The guy they're fighting right now who tackled and they're doing the shadow special to and all that, is this the guy who is, like, the antidote that I have? No, was... he, he, he okay. got punched. That guy got shoved foliage. into the bushes. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Right now, what it is, so there are four guys. Uh, one just got punched into the foliage. One just threw a dagger. One was sort of on that side and threw a dagger at Angelo. One, the, another just tackled Angelo. And then the fourth is uh, the one who used his blow dart on Dingo, and he has, and he's sort of trying to slink back as well. Okay. I, I just want to throw out there that, you know, wh- while this is happening... Felina, you know, just does a acrobatic um, sort of cartwheel, like, uh, away from Dingo, and is just sort of, like, jogging past them, you know, looking over at them like, oh, wow, they're doing a whole thing there, as she, like, cartwheels and jogs over to um, the bush where the guy who had the Annie Venom fell in. She, she's going over to him. Just okay, to gotcha. All right, so... uh Hero, yeah. Do you go in for a kick? Uh, do your damage. Absolutely. Oh damn, that's max on my. Oh thing. wow. Fucking okay. go for it. Yeah, you <laughs> just yeah. kick it. If I yes, he he just goes ha <laughs> ha, and then none. Yeah, you kick him like right in the gut, and like you like immediately like hunches over, like sort of spits out, and like like has to like and is just sort of off of Angelo. Uh sort of like immediately. Just like just sort of just like just like the impact just like you just knock the completely like he like coughs up like a, a like a like a horrid like almost there's a bit of blood in there. You <laughs> punctured something probably as he like as he just curls over as he not curls over uh as he just sort of falls over to the side of Angelo but uh in doing that you sort of uh let yourself be open to uh the oh, guy Neo. who had thrown his dagger oh yeah? okay Neo I know how a- after Hero does it he ends up just doing a pose pointing at the guy he kicked and he just goes now count your sins yeah and that's when you're uh oh, sort of set upon by the guy who threw the dagger, who first threw the dagger, he has another dagger <laughs> uh, that he sort of gets behind you with and uh, like grabs you and is about to jab and is about to like jab into your neck. Oh no! So, yeah, he holds you. He's he's holding you. He's about to jab right into your neck. So uh, yeah, but Angelo, the the guy who was to <laughs> tackle you, is like knocked out out entirely okay. next well... to you. All right, I got a plan because I just got knocked down. He, oh, I just got knocked down. He's been knocked off me. Hero saved me, and now I'm gonna save Hero. <laughs> I don't have anything. I I only have the vamp. God, I don't have any throwing weapons, but you know what I do have. Wait, bag of books. Oh, shit. <laughs> so yeah, Angelo is gonna like just kind of reach as while well, he's still on his back, just kind of reach into bag of books, and he's gonna like throw a hard back at the guy who's like charging. <laughs> All right, roll volley. Yeah. So, 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 just what? Well, just at the guy who is. Like, I'm trying to trying stop. To, like... I'm trying to stop him from like. I don't care if this does damage. I just want to 
get Hero out of the situation of getting stabbed, basically. Right, right. Okay, yeah, yeah roll volley. Roll volley. No. Uh, nope, you miss. And yeah, you do say you do say hit the books at the top of your lungs. <laughs> I do, though, but it just but yeah, it just yeah. is completely off course. <laughs> but yeah, so yeah, Hero. Uh, Angelo throws a book at your direction, and uh, no. now there is Nani? a knife, now there is a dagger at your throat. No. Wait, is the book throwing going at me, or is the, no? So the, I think it's just going goes, wide. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and uh, guy. Hisses in your ear. I'm gonna remove a use of bag of books. Like yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Guy hisses in your ear like, this is, they're like, this is way okay. Okay, fair, yeah, this is gonna be way faster acting if it goes through the fucking jugular. Whoa, oh. no need for swearing, big guy. Oh, calm down here, guy. This is a family I'm... show. We just hey, come on. Hmm. We just do animal <laughs> acts. Actually, Neil. Hmm. Okay, what? Neil. Neil. I'll what? give you a deal. I can I can try and teleport. <laughs> I can... No, okay, man. Not so. I mean, I could just trivialize this, but to make it a bit more fun, I should probably roll for it because hero can you know a bit hard to concentrate, but like teleport behind him, just you know, since he slipstreams. Mm-hmm. 